All right, guys, we're back with another Engine Cam Man review. Now, this one here is a special one. I've had this one for a little while. I started keeping the back car. I started to save for a special occasion on this one. But uh, before I get started on this uh, energy drink here, we got please like, subscribe, and comment. Now, we're doing the uh, Sweet Black Cold Brew Monster, the Java Monster. So, this is a coffee brew energy drink. I usually don't mess with these. Um, I just don't really. I like them. Don't get me wrong. I like them. I really like, I used to drink them when they first came out, but um, they just don't hit as hard. They don't get me energized as, like, say, the other ones did, or like a red, like, I usually was still drinking a lot of the uh, Monster Low Carbs back then, and they just didn't get me energized. Now, I like the taste, and but the only problem with I would suck them down a lot. Like, I mean, I was just sucking down, like, five minutes, and it still didn't, it, it can't, I just sucked it down too fast. Like, you know, when you were paying more back then, you know, now they're, like, the same price as a regular Monster, but... Back then, they were um, more expensive, so when I brought them in, I just sucked them down faster. Or so, but um, so like I said, this is a coffee brew. I hadn't seen this one. I was just still having chopping around for any drink, and I found this one, cold brew here. And the rate my reason I picked up was because I looked on the caffeine level, and this had 200 milligrams for caffeine. So that kind of sparked my interest in it. Like I, I didn't compare it at the store to the other one. I'm gonna definitely do other Java. Or and, and like Starbucks, other coffee, you know, mixes. Cause I know there's a lot more in the market now, so we're definitely gonna give it a try. Um, it does say nice infused coat, so cold brew, roast, medium origin imported, uh, profile sweet, full body. And it's a little bit smaller can. It's at 13 and a half. Usually are like 16. That probably because it's got something in there. I probably need to check it up, but don't say. Um, it's got, it says with zero sugar, which does, it's only got 10 calories. There's no sweetener in there. They said for 10 calories. Total fat, zero. Sodium, 330 milligrams. That's a lot of sodium. Total carbohydrate, three. Total sugar, zero. Uh, calcium, 30 milligrams. Potassium, 30 milligrams. Vitamin C, 60%. Uh, B2, 210. B3, 210. And B6, 200. So, a little low on the B vibes. Not real low, but. Uh, for monster brand line anyway that's kind of low so but it does have a lot of caffeine in it so I'm very still tend to try it and i'd like to i do like the coffee blend i just i don't mainly drink them because they just seem like they were more back at the time when i would drink you know it came out they just seem like there was more money for less effect so that's what i did now don't get me wrong thank you Mm, I smell like a fresh brew of coffee, so let's give this thing a try. I got me a cup of ice with it, said a cup, you know, just ice and add no water to this one. So let's see what you got when you come out. Wow, that it does look like coffee. Like a straight up coffee out of pot. A little light, but got a little carbonation in there, so I don't know. Damn, it never smells like coffee, though. I can smell the coffee out the cup, I ain't even got to smell it, so. Definitely cold brew. It's found me a top. Let me see. Not bad. Not bad. It's trying to taste like a frappe or a crap or whatever you know, the frappe and all that. I'm trying to taste like one of them. It's not either like a little more creamer in it. It had a little more creamer in it. it it'd be all right. So we got a little foam on top there. Yeah, I mean, it, it's like, I don't know if it's trying to like actually taste like a fat or something like that to help. So you ain't got to add creamer to it, but I'm sure it will. I sure do want to go you know, like get like some little creamers from the work break thing and pour in here, and I think that'd be pretty straight with this. I mean, it's got the coffee smell down, and it does got the taste down. I wouldn't say it's my favorite coffee though. I've all like the other Java's Monster coffee blends and all that. And it ain't it won't take the best to me, like I said, but. Definitely want to give these a try because of the uh, 200 milligrams of caffeine, like I said. So, I ain't never seen the can before, so I definitely wanted to give it a try on the cold brew sweet black. So, um, I mean, it definitely got a black taste. That's why I like it. It's kind of like it does have like a, just a straight, 
just has a straight um dark coffee taste to it but um oh it got nitro infused coffee so that's there it was but it's not like it's not sweet i think i think probably because it's just not since it's not as sweet and don't have the sugar in it i think that kind of was killing it there Yeah, that kind of what killed it. Yeah, I don't know if I would add ice to it. No, I probably would just drink one out of the can next time to see. Maybe they're a little different there. But if it kind of tastes, it does. It tastes like a craft head that was like watered down a little bit or like sat down on the shelf a little bit longer than it should have. So before you drunk it. So I would, I would rate that one. Uh, like I said, from what I'm saying on the energy level on this, like I said, it does have two milligrams, but it had a little low on the B. So I'm going to give it like a seven on the uh energy level there but the taste like it's trying to taste like a frappe but then it's trying to i don't know if it's like you're trying to infuse too many things at one time and then it just kind of kind of bland itself out a little bit but like you taste it but then it just like it needs it needed a cream or sugar there in there to finish it out because it comes into coffee you know what i'm saying like i don't think you're trying to make one with no sugar but like when you're making a coffee, most people nowadays have sugar and cream in it somehow, some way, or like using a um, Splenda or something they should use. But not bad. It's not good. The rest of the jar monsters on that. And if I get some other one, I do like. Like I said, I did like the other one. That just at that time it wasn't worth it for me to get these, but I'll definitely be trying these now. But um, like I said not bad overall. I probably get like a six point five. You know, like the taste is probably like it's like a 5.5. 5. I won't, I don't want to give it a five because it's not like terrible, but it needs some improvement. So, you know, what I'm saying like that's why I like I don't want to say it's like a six because it's not that terrible, but I don't want to say the five because it's technically not bad. Like, I don't want to drink this, so that's why I give like a 5.5 5 on that. And then, like I said, the energy level probably like a seven, I would say. But uh, that's all I got on this quick little break here on this old cold brew here. Like I said, Sweet Black Monster product line. I had the first one trying one of these. So like I said, please like, try to comment, tell me what you think on these. If you ever had any or you seen any other flavors, maybe, maybe I can try to look them up and see if I can get them. But other than that, y'all have a uh, blessed morning on a hump day. And let's go on and get back and get it on the grind.